I'd sort of decided that I was going to give the YouTube stuff a rest for a, a few days purely as a, a tiny mark of respect for the Duke of Edinburgh. Um, and then you see such, on Facebook everywhere really, such disrespectful, clueless parasites that uh, want to make a mockery of it got nothing to do with who he was the the fact that they're they're making vile remarks about the, the death of a 99 year old man is bad enough um that proves to me that he was worth a hundred of every single one of you parasites but to then have found a story on youtube of two cretins rank first class assholes who look on the surface to have been old enough to know better, to be outside Buckingham Palace threatening to open uh, bottles of uh, some cheap, pointless bubbly um, in celebration uh, of Prince Philip's death. Oh, my God, it, it's... I have to be thankful that I'm of an age and of a state of health where I'm not able to be up there because if this was five years ago, 10 years ago, I swear to God, I would have ripped you limb from limb, you disgusting assholes. Um, they look like they may well have been uh, students at one time. They're both from a little bit old to, to be students now. Maybe they're not though. I mean, people go to university for the rest of their life, don't they? Um, but for you to have been there, on a Friday, looks to me like you was probably you're probably out of work. Let's be fair. You probably went to university, uh, wasted four years on um, gender studies or some other um, social uh, social justice type degree, the the liberal arts or whatever other pointless uh, tasks you performed while you was there, and then you expect to be able to walk outside Buckingham Palace with that vile attitude and somehow you've got away with it i can remember a time in london not that many years ago where you would have been well i i hesitate to say what might have happened to you but it would have been deserved you disgusting assholes and every single one of you that have made some ridiculous deridery comment either on a youtube video or on a uh, facebook post on a Twitter post, whatever, you all need to be ashamed. You're worthless. Absolutely worthless. Quick little addendum to this. I've just looked at this, this uh, photograph a little bit, a uh, little bit more closely. Seems to me that if uh, we put a little bit of effort into it, we can make these two pricks quite famous. Uh, this one was a little red ring around him. Uh, just looks like your you average nobody, really. Just a, a, a smart ass looking to create a problem um, so that he can then claim that the police beat him up and whatever. This other geezer here is on. Now, I don't know how things. I know that Santander used to have bikes that used, you'd put a credit card in and pedal off on it. Uh, maybe this is the same. Or maybe um, he actually works for. Uber. Let's find out. Let's try and find out who this prick is, shall we? Because uh, I'm getting sick to death of these silly bastards having a pop at normal people like me, normal people like us, all the normal people that watch these type of videos, especially you, Terry Ann. I know you tune in. Um, let's see if we can find out who these two jokers are and get them cancelled, or better still, banged up, vile assholes. Just have a closer look. I'll leave it up there for a little bit longer. Anybody knows who they are, where they are, get in touch. We'll make them famous. How's your father?